Hi, I want to go over one of the quiz questions that are in the Chapter 2 section. Uh, the question actually refers to calculating a missing value when you're looking at manufacturing costs, total manufacturing costs. A couple things that you have to understand. The terminology, and I've got abbreviations in here, DM for direct materials, direct labor, DL, MOH for manufacturing overhead. The three of those combined equals your total manufacturing costs. So understanding that prime cost is DM, direct materials, plus your direct labor portion is important. Knowing that you can take your raw materials, direct materials, and add labor and overhead to convert materials, parts, into a finished product, that is called conversion cost. Direct labor plus manufacturing overhead are the costs associated with converting direct materials into a finished product. In the particular example that I am going over right now, the direct labor cost was given to us. So I've kind of put direct labor here at 20405 Okay, They give us the information that it represents 55% of prime. If it represents 55% of prime, then 45% is going to be the direct material. Because again, prime is 100%. 45, if 55 is given as labor, then to get to 100, material must be 45%. I don't really need that piece to do the computations. What I need to understand, okay, is that with the information given, I can set up a ratio. So that's my first step. I'm going to take 2405 and I'm going to say it's 55% of prime. To calculate what 100% of prime is, I set up the ratio 2405 x being the variable that I don't know, the total amount of prime, okay, we know that prime is 100%, okay, so then I use the cross multiplication technique. I'm going to take x, the total, times 55%, and I know that that equals 20,405 that was given to me. So then I divide, okay, both sides by 0.55 in this case. And then x, the total amount of prime, because remember, that's what x is equal to, the total is 37,100. If I was asked to compute the material portion, I know that total is 37,100. So what I would do is I would subtract the part given to me, which was the labor portion. So then I'd be able to figure out that 16,695 is equal to the direct material portion. That was not what was asked of me in this particular question. In this question, they asked me what the manufacturing overhead was. Okay, so that is the piece that I want to calculate. In calculating that, I go back and substitute in what I know. I know that total prime, DM plus DL, is 37,100. They gave me total manufacturing cost of 73,600. This is a simple subtraction problem. 73,600, and I'm going to subtract 37,100. And I get that my manufacturing cost is 36,500. And you can see from the example up above, that the correct answer was 36.5.